In this video, we've got a whole bunch of different objects. And what we're going to try and do is count how many of each object we have and then put them in order. Okay, so let's get started with these red counters. So we've got these red counters here, so I'm going to spread them out to make them nice and easy to count. And we'll see how many we have. So, we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 red counters. Fantastic. So let's put those 11 red counters over here. And we're going to put the number 11 underneath. Great. Uh, what should we do next? How about we go and we do our yellow counters. So again, we're going to spread them out so they're nice and easy to count. We don't count the same one twice by accident. And then let's give a count of these yellow counters. So we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 yellow counters. So let's have a look here. We've got 11 red counters and 14 yellow counters. So we know there's 14 is bigger than 11, so let's put 14 yellow counters next to the 11 like that. So it goes 11, 14. Uh, what should we do next? How about we do our yellow sticks? So this one should be pretty easy. We've got one, two, three yellow sticks. Three yellow sticks, that's much less than 14, and it's also much less than 11. So what we might have to do, we might have to shift these along, we'll erase those. We'll put our 11, our three sticks, sorry, there, we'll put our number three underneath. And we had 11 red, I remember, counters. We had 14 yellow counters. What's next? We've got our green counters. So let's spread them out again. Let's have a look at how many green counters we have. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Is seven less than 14? I think it's less than 14. It's also less than 11, but it's more than three. So this time we're gonna move our 14 yellow counters over a little bit like that. We'll write it down this time, just so we don't have to remember. I hate to forget what that is and have to count them all over again. We'll move our 11 yellow, uh, yellow, 11 red counters over here. And then we'll slot our seven green counters up into there. Beautiful. So now we've got three, seven, 11, 14, all in the right order. Excellent. Uh, let's do our green sticks next. We've just done our green counters. Let's do our green sticks. So we'll spread these out again, so we're not counting them twice. Oop, try and prevent them from rolling everywhere. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six. Six green sticks. So that's less than 14. It's less than 11. It's just less than seven, but it's bigger than three. So, I think, actually, we'll just squish our 11 over a little bit. I think we can just kind of squish it in here, rather than having to move everything. So we'll just kind of make room. Seven goes there. Squeeze the six green sticks up into there. Beautiful. We've got three, six, seven, 11, 14. What's next? How about we have a look at our blue sticks? So, we've got one, two, three blue sticks. Well, we know three is smaller than 14. We know it's smaller than 11. We know it's smaller than seven. We know it's smaller than six. Three yellow sticks, three blue sticks, that's exactly the same. So we can take our blue sticks and we can put them here with our yellow sticks because we know that's the same. We've got the same number of blue sticks as we do yellow sticks. Uh, what next? How about our red sticks? This should be really easy. One, one red stick. 
So 1, well that's a lot less than 14, it's a lot less than 11, it's a lot less than 7, it's a lot less than 6, and it's even less than 3. So we can slot our 1 red stick right down the end here. We just kind of squeeze it in there so we don't have to rewrite those numbers all over again. So we're going 1, 3, 6, 7, 11, 14. What have we got left? We've got some blue counters and we've got some yellow blocks. So let's finish off our counters. Well, there's a lot of these blue counters, so we better space them out and put them in groups. Let's go groups of two again. So that way we don't count them twice. All right, so let's see how many blue counters we have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fourteen? That's the same number of blue counters as we have of yellow counters. So we can put them all in a nice big group under the fourteen with the yellow counters. You know, that's pretty funny. We've got 14 yellow counters, 14 blue counters, and three yellow sticks, and three blue sticks. I wonder if we have 14 yellow blocks. Let's find out. So again, there's lots of yellow blocks, so we better put them in groups of two. So we don't count them twice by accident. There we go, I think they're good now. So let's count them. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 20 yellow blocks. Well, is 20 bigger than 1? It's bigger than 1. Is 20 bigger than 3? It's bigger than 3. Is 20 bigger than 6? It's bigger than 6. Is 20 bigger than 7? It's bigger than 7. Is 20 bigger than 11? It's bigger than 11. Is 20 bigger than 14? It's bigger than 14. So we're going to take our 20 blocks, sit them right down the end here, and we're going to write our number 20. So there you go. In this video, we've counted all these different objects and we've put them in order from their smallest to their biggest all the way from number one one red stick to 20 yellow blocks good work